Hi everyone and welcome to Mad Tech Talk. So within the Mad Tech Talk, you know, I like to cover those uh, news and maybe some leaks and things which I also found online before some of the tech actually hits the markets. And within this video, I'm actually looking at uh, what's happening to these Samsung Galaxy Z Fold 6 and the Z Flip 6 because we can see on already a few sites and this is a pretty fresh news that they're looking to hit some big upgrades for the foldables so we're looking that um, the z fold 6 and galaxy z flip are expected to launch around july time and i think this is pretty awesome because they're rolling with improved anti-reflecting screen tech and outer display possibly borrowed from the galaxy s24 ultra and it's gorilla glass arm protection i think that's a great upgrade because yeah it's just well needed on those um, fold and flip phones the leak also points to a maximum of 16 gig of ram for the book style foldable and up to 12 gig on the samsung galaxy z fold 5 and storage option of 256 gig 512 and one terabyte so one terabyte i think it's a good one especially if you, in a way you're connecting a phone with a tablet right so in a way you need more storage even if it's you know one device and i think you know this is a uh, kind of well case so as for whether the phone will come with an s pen they're not confirmed so that's kind of something which um you know it's still in the in the conversation but the good thing is, is and thank you for the uh, KRO and some mobile for the information and they say as much as 12 gig of ram is this time around depending on the region and can be 8 gig in the samsung galaxy z, z5 flip so that's pretty cool so uh, we're looking that um uh, according to the tipster some version of that phone will have the exynos processor inside for the first time while the cover screen is set to get an upgrade to 120 hertz refresh rate matching the internal display with that particular spec so that means both the screens now will have that and i think that's a pretty big um, upgrade on another side we actually found uh, a bit more details about that because i wanted to see more about that processor and we can see that and um, the leaks are saying that galaxy z flip 6 might launch with that exynos 2400 soc processor we're also looking that's um, expected to ship with 50 megapixel primary camera 12 megapixel secondary sensor camera and that 120 hertz um, refresh rate on the outer screen which i mentioned before so um i think that's pretty cool uh, but they're talking about the exynos 2400 um, but also tip to come with the Qualcomm Snapdragon 8 Gen and 3 SoC. So we'll see how it actually goes. And I think this is um, a pretty cool thing because um, obviously like that, that might bring a lot of uh, different traction. And looking that um, Samsung is uh, kind of with their phones on the very cool kind of path, especially with their option to use um, DeX, for example. That's something which um, I'm lately really looking into because um like samsung dex is something which um i think many people don't know about if you have a samsung i think from s22 up you can actually use those decks the only challenge with dex is, is that um if you have a lower phones uh, like like older phones you can only use it through the cable uh, through the cable to connect it to the um, uh, to the for example screen or the samsung tv with the newer ones they actually upgraded that so um i'm just going to cover that quickly because some of you actually don't know but with the samsung galaxy dex allows you to use your phone uh, as a kind of a full-size desktop pc and i think this is a pretty cool because in the dex mode you can actually work on your um the tv on your extra monitor on like a big screen and i think this is a cool thing especially in those foldable phones because that gives you like a small workstation i'll just maybe add some keyboard to it and then you have a great station to work and for those of you who are you know really kind of um pushing on the flexibility on having uh you know a compact lifestyle i think it's a great choice this is it from me i hope you enjoyed that video if yes you know what to do just hit that like and subscribe and see you in the next video take care